Fish tank update uh, <clears throat> as of now. October 2017. Uh, October 10, <laughs> 2017. I just finished feeding them. Daphne. And I still have a few more left. Or actually, it's not few. <laughs> I still have tons more left. Kurama is still actually hunting for a few more in his tank so it's kind of like doing his thing because I was looking at around that area it seems that most of the Daphne is actually there stayed there when I actually throw them into the fish tank or to his tank while Nube, which is my new addition to my babies, are actually finished with eating and the Koris together with him is, I think they're already full. While Eder's tank, as you can see, they're still trying to Go for a few more and they're trying to clean the surroundings for the rest of the Daphnius well this is Gary <laughs> and there's Serenity they are actually already done with eating as well for a bit I guess or they're still trying to finish off a few more if there's still a few more that they can find in the tank so it's actually a mess. I'm not a good aquascaper. I'm not a good plant keeper. But most of the plants that I put into their tank are all live. They're all live plants. So when I check the water parameters, ammonia is still zero. The the nitrite. Uh, I mean nitrate is also still zero zero ppm nitrite is still the same but I guess I'm gonna check it tomorrow because last week those were the readings I usually do the evaluation of the actual water conditions um, every week and I haven't changed the filter floss like this one, this one is actually a little bit dirty, but planning to still keep it a few more weeks, I'm not sure. This one as well, and that one as well. So, so far, everything is going well, though. Most recent event that I, one of my or one of my favorite, which is Ryzen, was dead died actually but in a few days I've moved on and I was able to luckily find Nube and Nube there <laughs> and his fins are a little bit torn uneven the right one is still trying to grow a bit so the left one is bigger than the right, so the, his anal fins are actually growing back. So the pectoral fins, I think, uh, the one on the right, is still trying to grow. So presently, that's my update with my fish tank and the Daphnia yeah? that I have which is not focusing there still I don't know if I'm gonna throw it away to the sink or just gonna keep it tomorrow and give it to some someone who's gonna be needing it or I'm just gonna go to the pet store that I usually go and my culture is like this so my culture still has a few more inside I've just added recently two apple snails to be able to like clean a bit 
things in here. Not sure if it's 3D algae or what, but hopefully they'll be able to go through with this in a few days. We'll see. And as you can see, there's still a few more Daphnia. And actually, there's a lot of Daphnia still in this culture that I have. Uh, seems that I was able to make sure to continue on making them flourish or grow. So this time, I know my rhythm. I know how to keep them. So I was able to f understand what to do much more better this time. These are Daphne and Moina. Or Moina. The, the Magna one. The Magna ones are bigger. But this one is not. So oh. I'm uh, thinking that it's Daphne and Moina. So that's it. That's my update at this time. This other culture. There's still a few more there. I'm not harvesting anything of it. I'm just letting it through. I'm just continue feeding it. But I guess in a few days I might dump some of the daphnias in here. So this is how my materials are. So it's kind of like crazy. I don't have my own fish room because the room is actually small. So rented room that I have. But anyways, so I keep my fish and they're actually growing. So going fine doing well everything is being maintained pretty well so everything is healthy everyone's healthy so i'm okay with it happy fish keeping guys thanks for watching